Welcome to the John and Heidi Show podcast. John and Heidi. Here's John and Heidi. Today is a special day, Heidi. Do you know what today is? What is today, John? Uh, I folks would never ask, Heidi. Today is Monday, February the 20th. Today is National Cherry Pie Day. Ooh, I love cherry pie. National Comfy Day today. National Leadership Day today. National Love Your Pet Day. We're gonna every see if, day should be yeah, love your pet day. We're gonna see if day. Cassie, our dog, can make it through the whole program without making noise because we have our dog with us since it's Love Your Pet Day. And I just heard her shake and her collar was clinking. Yes, so it was. You may have heard that as well. National Muffin Day today and President's Day today. All of these things happening on this Monday, the twentieth of February. It's also a movie star Monday. I'm so excited to visit with Patricia Heaton and her husband, David Hunt. She seems like such a neat lady. They were in a movie together that we've seen, Mom's Night Out. She was the pastor's wife. He was the cab driver in that. Yeah. And uh, again, these two both really cool people. They're working together on another project. We're going to chat with them all about it. I wish I had 15 minutes instead of just five, but we'll do that later in the program on this Movie Star Monday. Do you ever get credit card offers in the mail? Those are usually the worst offers. They spend thousands of dollars mailing them to anyone with an address. The people who actually read their junk mail end up paying the price in the long run. At BetterCreditCards.com, we offer a variety of credit card options to fit your needs. Whether you want a credit card to give you cash back or points and perks or a credit card to help you build your credit we probably have it at bettercreditcards.com give yourself a little credit bettercreditcards.com now surveys and studies and such brought to you by bettercreditcards.com being in the top end of the income scale does not necessarily mean you're any smarter than the average bear uh, according to a new study. Uh, more interestingly, those in the top 1% of the earning scale score lower in cognitive ability tests, not higher. Swedish researchers based their findings on data from 60,000 Swedish men who completed a military conscription test aged 18 or 19. They found no evidence that those with the top jobs that pay extraordinary wages are more deserving of those than those who only earn half the wages. The researchers concluded that when it comes to a very high earner, the resources available due to someone's family background and lucky breaks and careers carry far more weight than overall you intelligence. Yep. So like they say, sometimes it's not what you know, it's something else. Oh, it's who you know. That's what it was. <laughs> See, I was just kidding. I knew that. Surveys and studies and such brought to you by BetterCreditCards.com. If your plan for the new year involves getting your financial life in order, I suggest you start with your mobile phone bill. How much do you pay every month? If that number is more than 15 bucks, it's time for a Mintervention. Mint Mobile makes it affordable and easy to switch. Get a new phone or bring your current phone at Mintervention.com. You can see the current special offers from Mint Mobile, offering premium wireless for just $15 a month. That's far less than most people are paying. Just $15 a month. Learn more now at Mintervention.com. That's Mintervention.com. Now, did you know? Brought to you by RadioTravelGroup.com. Heidi, did you know? An unopened first generation iPhone from 2007 hit the auction block. Estimated value of $50,000. It sold back in 07 for $599. The first iPhone offered a 3.5 inch screen with a 2 megapixel camera plus 4 gigabytes and 8 gigabytes gigabytes of storage options, internet capabilities, and iTunes. It had no app store because that didn't exist yet. It ran on a 2G network, and it was exclusive to the AT&T network. LCG Auctions, which is handling the sale, sold a similar unopened first-generation iPhone for over $39,000 back in October. Apple enthusiasts have until the 19th of February which was yesterday, so <laughs> a lot of good that's doing us now. I doubt anybody that's here is, we're not bidding on that, are we? I don't think so. Uh, no. You you are? No? No, nobody is. All right. We don't know everything, but now we know this. John and Heidi. Now, big screen, little screen, brought to you by ChannelSurferTV.com. I love Danny Trejo. Sad news, he's filing for bankruptcy. He said, it's not because he's broke. It's just the best way to resolve a nagging bill with the IRS. He's 78. The machete actor told a reporter he planned to file Chapter 11 bankruptcy as a way to reorganize his assets to help deal with a tax bill of about $2 bucks that he says isn't even correct. So 
It's kind of sad. And I love you, you love me. Barney. Barney's coming back to your TV. Yeah, there's a reboot of Barney. 1990s children TV show with a famous purple dinosaur officially in the works. And I saw the new rollout. Uh, they got like the new image of what he's going to look like. It's a newer, cooler Barney. A cooler but Barney. Would it be hard to be cooler than the original Barney? <laughs> so, hey. <laughs> I'm just saying. Barney was and great. if you're looking for a unique bit of showbiz memorabilia maybe some tidy whities from brian cranston breaking wow. bad it's hitting the auction block along other really interesting pieces of hollywood swag our dog is here for bring your dog to work today she's jingle she clearly doesn't jingle care about jangle. the story uh anyway the briefs are expected to fetch around five grand that is insane Auction is open through the end of the month i've John, got all the info well, let's auction no. off some of yours no let's not <laughs> all the info in the show notes for today at john and heidi show.com do you ever get credit card offers in the mail those are usually the worst offers they spend thousands of dollars mailing them to anyone with an address the people who actually read their junk mail end up paying the price in the long run at bettercreditcards.com we offer a variety of credit card options to fit your or needs. Whether you want a credit card to give you cash back or points and perks or a credit card to help you build your credit, we probably have it at bettercreditcards.com. Give yourself a little credit. bettercreditcards.com. Now your scoop of the day comes your way courtesy of bettercreditcards.com. 9-year-old David Balogun is not only one of the youngest ever high school grads, he's already finished a semester of community college. Did I mention he's 9? Holy the young cow. brainiac lives with his family family in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. They began high school, or he did, just before COVID-19 in 2020. Took specially designed classes remotely, graduating with a 4.0 GPA before 2022. His mother, Rania, says that her son was tested for giftedness in first grade. He skipped several grades in elementary school and has a particular interest in science and computer programming, but also loves sports and piano playing. The youngster, who's already a member of a high IQ group by the name of Mensa, says he wants to be an astrophysicist who studies black holes and supernovas. He's already obtained a few credits at college, and his family is currently searching for other colleges or universities, uh, universities rather, that may be a good fit for their nine-year-old son. That's insane. Graduated high school, already got some semesters of college done at nine. <laughs> Isn't that? Insane. But it's amazing, too. All right. Wow. Uh, I just want to make sure everybody knows that because we had mentioned earlier, it's National Love Your Pet Day. We have our dog in the studio. I've been trying to get her to make some noise. She's jingling her collar. <laughs> Cassie, hey, you going to say something? Who is it? <laughs> Aww, yeah, what a good girl. Nice. Yeah, I just pretend like there's somebody here. That's all I had to do. I knew Aww. I could get her to say something. All right, scoop of the day comes your way. Courtesy of BetterCreditCards.com. Oh, by the way, if you happen to have a pet with you, I apologize for getting them riled up. <laughs> Thanks for listening to The John and Heidi Show. If your plan for the new year involves getting your financial life in order, I suggest you start with your mobile phone bill. How much do you pay every month? If that number is more than 15 bucks, it's time for a Mintervention. Mint Mobile makes it affordable and easy to switch. Get a new phone or bring your current phone at Mintervention.com. You can see the current special offers from Mint Mobile, offering premium wireless for just $15 a a month. That's far less than most people are paying. Just $15 a month. Learn more now at Mintervention.com. That's Mintervention.com. Thank you for listening to the John and Heidi show on this Movie Star Monday. I'm so excited to visit with our guests today. Like my wife and I work together, we have a husband and wife who work together. We have Patricia Heaton, who you've probably seen on a bunch of great movies and TV shows. Uh, the list is long, but I'm going to give you some of the highlights. Everybody Loves Raymond, The Middle, and then one of the movies that I absolutely love is called Mom's Night Out. And in that, she actually gets to work with her real-life husband, David. And his list of projects goes on and on as well. And right now, we're going to talk to them about a new project that they're working on together. And I guess we'll just start by saying welcome to the program. Thanks for joining us. How are you doing? We're great, John. Thanks for having us. I am excited to visit with you about the new movie that you guys had a chance to work on together. Now, this is more of a behind-the-scenes where you're producing and you're directing. And uh, I had a chance to watch Mom's night out where the two of you are also on screen and this is not your first time working together so do you guys kind of enjoy working together patricia i think it's a it's a it's a challenge you have to uh you know set up your lines of communication and understand what the hierarchy is and sort of you know everybody needs to know what their lane is and then stay in it so uh and we don't always succeed but <laughs> 
Yeah, go ahead, Dave. This is the, the, it was the one chance I had of being in charge, John. So I'm clearly not in charge, but on the movie set, I was. The buck stopped with me. I love that. Now, the new film is called Unexpected, and I know both of you are working behind the scenes, directing and producing. And, uh, Patricia, are you on screen at all in this new film, or is it all behind the scenes on this project? So, yeah, our movie, Unexpected, uh, which is available on iTunes and Amazon Prime and any other renting platform, is a wonderful comedy about this couple, Bob and Amy, who can't have kids. Amy wants to adopt. Bob doesn't. And it's a funny, quirky, moving journey through their marriage dealing with this situation. And I was a producer, so I happily got to sit behind the camera eating my bagel and watching all the actors sweat it out in front of the camera. Um, and um, I really enjoy the producing process. I enjoy the development process, which is where you you know you take a story and turn it into a script and try to get it to work. So it was really lovely to just sort of give birth to this project as a producer. And her husband David is joining us as well, David Hunt. And you were the director on this film. Were you on screen at all, or strictly directing only? No, I was not. Um... I just enjoy the storytelling part. This was a new, a really a new departure for me because I, I directed a couple of things, smaller things before, but this is my first full-length feature, and um, I was, uh, I was involved in it from the very beginning, from optioning the book, some 18 years ago, uh, writing the script and storyboarding, and I, I just, I just loved the whole process of being involved in every conceivable you know juncture i love that now my wife and i do a radio show together and i've had people many times say how in the world can you work with your spouse you guys are doing this as well you've done a couple of movies together now for sure patricia do you see maybe another project in the future where the two of you get to work together again yes we're currently um you know trying to push a few other boats out on some feature films some tv series so we're always got a lot of airplanes in air traffic control and just trying to bring one down to land and it's a crazy, tricky, difficult business, and only insane people would be in the entertainment industry. But So I guess that makes us certifiable, but we enjoy it. That's awesome. But, you know, it's a good kind of insane, right? Correct. Yeah. The whole world is insane, so you might as well be, on the, be the right kind of insanity. And, David, you said this is the first time you've directed a feature-length film. Do you like that director seat? Do you see yourself there again? I turned to Patty in the first week of filming and said, I wish I'd started this 20 years ago because I took to it so easily. I don't mean that in a bragging way, just that I, I loved it so much. You know, people peppering me with thousands of questions, you know, all day long. I really enjoyed it because it's my, it's my vision up there, ultimately, because I edited the film as well. So I crafted the whole thing, really, along with the writer. So it was a very gratifying experience. So yes, uh, we're, we're actually looking to raise finance for the next project that we want to do, even as we speak. Well, I am excited to see where that goes, and I'm sure you'll have a lot of fun. Again, the new movie is out right now. It came out on February 1st on iTunes. It's called Unexpected. Our guests today have been Patricia Heaton and her husband, David Hunt. I've got a link to the new film in the show notes for today at johnandheidyshow.com. Do you ever get credit card offers in the mail? Those are usually the worst offers. They spend thousands of dollars mailing them to anyone with an address. The people who actually read their junk mail end up paying the price in the long run. At bettercreditcards.com, we offer a variety of credit card options to fit your needs. Whether you want a credit card to give you cash back or points and perks or a credit card to help you build your credit, we probably have it at bettercreditcards.com. Give yourself a little credit. bettercreditcards.com. Fun fact for you, Heidi. What's that, John? The least common day to be born is May 22nd. Really? I don't know why. That's weird. Fun fact for you, Heidi. What's that, John? The three most read books in the world are believed to be the Bible, quotations from Mao Te Sung. Uh, Mao Tse Sung, I think I said it wrong. <laughs> and Harry Potter is the number three most read book in the world. Wow. Yeah. Sounds like I can't read any of them the way I'm doing this today. Fun fact for you, Heidi. What's that, John? Fungus is more closely related to animals on a genetic level than they are to plants. That's interesting. Okay. Fun fact for you, Heidi. What's that, John? Amazon's largest warehouse is the size of 17 football fields. That's huge. Huh. Fun fact for you, Heidi. What's that, John? When you remember a past event, you're actually remembering the last time you remembered it, not the event itself. 
Interesting. And our final fun fact for you, Heidi. What's that, John? The Empire State Building only took a little over a year to build. It was completed 12 days ahead of schedule. That's pretty cool. Very cool. Several fun facts. Now you know. Thanks for listening to The John and Heidi Show. If your plan for the new year involves getting your financial life in order, I suggest you start with your mobile phone bill. How much do you pay every month? If that number is more than 15 bucks, it's time for a mint intervention. Mint Mobile makes it affordable and easy to switch. Get a new phone or bring your current phone at mintervention.com. You can see the current special offers from Mint Mobile, offering premium wireless for just $15 a month. That's far less than most people are paying. Just $15 a month. Learn more now at mintervention.com. That's mintervention.com. Time now for the Mint Mobile Question of the Day. Yay! It's brought to you by Mintervention.com. Here's your question, Heidi. In a survey, fully half of employees surveyed said they don't have this at work. What is it? A water cooler. No, the answer is friends. How oh, sad is that? that's sad. But I you know what? You go to work to work, not yeah, to make friends. Yeah, I have a friend at work. Her name is Heidi. Do you have any friends at work, Heidi? <laughs> <laughs> I've got acquaintances. <laughs> I don't go to work to make friends. uh I work with my wife. Sometimes that's (laughs) not good. Mint Mobile question of the day comes your way, courtesy of Mintervention.com. Do you ever get credit card offers in the mail? Those are usually the worst offers. They spend thousands of dollars mailing them to anyone with an address. The people who actually read their junk mail end up paying the price in the long run. At BetterCreditCards.com, we offer a variety of credit card options to fit your needs. Whether you want a credit card to give you cash back or... Or points and perks, or a credit card to help you build your credit, we probably have it at BetterCreditCards.com. Give yourself a little credit. BetterCreditCards.com. Now, some weird news brought to you by WeirdGiftOfTheDay.com. You thought beautiful people get all the breaks in life, right? Well, an employment expert says, not if you're searching for a job. If you're drop-dead gorgeous, you'd be wise to downplay your good looks for the interview. And a virtual TikTok career coach, Mandy Tang, describes the typical reaction to a beautiful job applicant from a hiring manager. Oh, she's like phenomenally beautiful? Well, that's annoying. And I bet she's a bleep, a bleep as well. Not, not, oh, not a nice word. No, that's the clip not a nice word. It's titled, What to Do When You're Really Hot During the Interview Process. Wow. Tang captioned the clip. If you're hot and you're not that smart or nice, that's what people are thinking. The, the She also suggests downplaying your good looks because there's actually going to be a bias against you. She really struggles because she apparently is beautiful. I've never had this problem during an interview. Usually they're saying, we don't know if our furniture will hold you. <laughs> <laughs> never once have I had them say, you might be too darn gorgeous you're to work here, John. You're too good looking to be here. You're way too good looking to be on the radio. I've never had that. <laughs> Weird news brought to you by WeirdGiftOfTheDay.com. John and Heidi. Time now for the list brought to you by BetterCreditCards.com. Heidi's favorite. The why is it? Like this. Why is it medium is the only size that doesn't come in extra? <laughs> extra small, oh, extra, extra small. large. I There's see. never extra medium. Why is it people look up when they think? Hmm, let me think about that. Uh, why is it the road signs that say slow children have a picture of a running child? They don't look slow at all. <sighs> why is it the severity of an itch is proportionate to your inability to reach it? That is very true. Yeah. Why is it women marry men hoping they will change, but men marry women hoping they won't? Oh, um, that's a one? great point. Why is it when you stand on your head, your face turns red, but when you stand on your feet, your legs don't turn red? <laughs> <laughs> and why is it when a lawyer writes a 10,000-word document, they call it a brief? Yeah, that's uh, true. Yeah. And our final, why is it biker gang chains, their biker gangs chain their wallet to their pants? Is anyone really dumb enough to try to pickpocket a biker? Yeah, no <laughs> doubt. I think that's so they don't fall off while they're riding their motorcycles. There you go. That's a good, that uh, wouldn't be as funny though. So uh, no. thank you. <laughs> The list brought to you by BetterCreditCards.com. If your plan for the new year involves getting your financial life in order, I suggest you start with your mobile phone bill. How much do you pay every month? If that number is more than 15 bucks, it's time for a Mint intervention. Mint Mobile makes it affordable and easy to switch. Get a new phone or bring your current phone at Mintervention.com. You can see the current special offers from Mint Mobile, offering premium wireless for just $15 a month. That's far less than most people are paying. Just $15 a month. Learn more. More now at Mintervention.com. That's Mintervention.com. Time now for the quote of the day. It comes your way, courtesy of insurancechicken.com. A quote today from Robert Orban who says, 
Older people shouldn't eat healthy food. They need all the preservatives they can get. (laughs) I love that. Uh, That's a great quote. Quote of the day comes your way, courtesy of insurancechicken.com. They know a thing or two about quotes, by the way, Heidi. Insurance quotes. Eh, see? Yes, they do. Thanks for listening to The John and Heidi Show. John and Heidi. This portion of The John and Heidi Show is brought to you by The John and Heidi Show. That sounds kind of funny, but it's true. Go to your local radio station and ask them to start carrying The John and Heidi Show. Here's the best part. They can carry the show for free. They play a couple commercials, but it doesn't cost them anything every month. So if you know a radio station that could use a little bit of help, send them our way. Send them to johnandheidyshow.com. Again, johnandheidyshow.com. We would love to do a radio program in your community. Then you could listen to the podcast and listen to us on the radio. John and Heidi. We always like to wrap things up around here with good news, and I think this is good news. Comes your way courtesy of radiotravelgroup.com. A reminder, they're doing a contest, a trip to Cancun, Mexico, an event in October, an event we've been to. You can get all the details at radiotravelgroup.com. Uh, here's the headline. Barber goes viral for friendship with boy with special needs. Uh, this is in Cincinnati. He gives free haircuts to children with special needs, and as a result, he's made a friend. Uh, two years ago, Vernon Jackson had an idea to raise money to give free haircuts to children with disabilities. He calls the program Gifted. That's how he met a seven-year-old by the name of Ellison. Ellison has Down syndrome, has already been through three open-heart surgeries. Like most children with special needs, he faces challenges on a daily basis. And one of those is getting a haircut. He said, uh, Ellison, at any moment uh, in this haircut, if you need time for yourself or if you want me to stop, just say stop. And, uh, you know, when you're ready, just say you're ready. So they stop and go and stop and go. And ultimately, he said, uh, when it's all said and done, uh, by the time they're done, they're just cracking up. They're having fun. Because now Ellison knows that I'm in charge. I can make him stop whenever I want. It is really fun to watch the video. So uh, he said, uh, the son said he wanted to be viral on TikTok. So when they were doing the haircut, they were recording this, and it got posted on TikTok. And guess what? It It went went viral viral on TikTok. So cute. So it is really, really cool. And in this story that I'm uh, reading here, there's a link to a GoFundMe if you'd like to support Gifted. Uh, They set a goal of $15,000. It's blown past $21,000 already. Wow. I think that is awesome. I've got a link to all of this in the show notes for today at johnandheidyshow.com. Time to say goodbye, Heidi. Goodbye, Heidi. Goodbye, everybody. Have a great Monday. Thank you so much for listening to the John and Heidi Show.